What is racial bullying to you? To me, it is the idea that the bully feels they are more superior than another due to their race. Here's an example of that experience. A teenage hockey player targeted by bullies for the color of his skin. Their words taking a toll on his feelings and confidence. They like to say the N-word. I've heard that a lot. And they say monkey, and then they like to bang their chest. Just like the boy in the previous video, my bullying experience happened from the beginning of 2018 to the end of 2018. It happened in school, and it also happened in the classroom as well. When I was in the hallways, the boy would try and constantly say rude and disgusting things towards me, such as, look at Jade's ugly ass, Jade stop staring at me, stop looking at me, you're ugly. I also, in the classroom, dealt with him being rude and disgusting towards me and making fun of other girls as well. I am a 16-year-old girl and attend school in New Jersey. Since these problems of bullying have stemmed from, in my opinion, self-hatred, due to the boy being black and white, and ignorance, I believe he decided to take it out on me, and it's happening to friends of mine too. People would ask me questions like, oh, do you eat watermelon, do you eat fried chicken? You're not black enough because I'm mixed. But many of the people don't know if they are being racially bullied or not. So I decided to look into the facts of racial bullying. Here's what the New Jersey Office of the Attorney General says. It says that racial bullying is unlawful. The former term in New Jersey is bias-based harassment slash bullying. Schools are required to report such cases and can be held liable. When I finally told my mom about the situation, she immediately the next day called the school because she was very devastated about it. After my mom called the school, they took it to the vice principal and they called me down to the office to get my opinion about the situation. And finally, they called the boy down to the office the next day and they threatened him saying that he would be kicked off the football team and the wrestling team if he did not stop harassing me. So now he stopped. This was not the first time I have been racially bullied, however. I was nine years old at the time. Of course, I was a little kid, so I didn't really understand the situation. So basically, this guy in my class, and he was also a little boy because we were in the third grade, he decided to say and make a joke saying, guess how black people are made? They're cooked in an oven at 360 degrees and burned. When my mom called the school about the situation, they decided to suspend the boy for a week, but that still did not stop him because he still kept being rude to me and disrespectful during the whole entire year. And my teacher decided to blame me, saying that I wouldn't walk away from him. Mackenzie Adams was nine years old too. She was racially bullied by two classmates in Linden, Alabama. But the bullying was too much for her. And in December of 2018, she hanged herself in her grandmother's home. Said no. And before my baby to tell me some of the things that they had, you know, said to her, I was just like, where are they learning this from? Mackenzie's grandmother found her in their home last week. She had hanged herself. Just seeing my baby laying there, not being able to say nothing to me. My mother was just as devastated to hear that this was happening to me. I felt very limited. I felt afraid. I felt scared. I felt angry. I wanted to do something, but I knew that I had to let you kind of work it out. I wanted to help you process it so that you could be completely healed from it. But more importantly, I felt like so angry and upset. Here are some things that you can do to address the bullying. Talk to your parents if you're going through this. Go to your faculty at school that you can trust and talk to them to see what they can do to fix it. If it's serious, go to the authorities and file a complaint or to see if you would like to press charges. Look up your rights and see what can be done about the bullying you are going through.